how to talk to your children about a divorce. Asking for a divorce, as we know, is an incredibly intimidating conversation to have. And many of us put it off because divorce is a life-altering decision that has long-term and unpredictable changes. But after the decision is made up and you have let your emotions calm down a bit between the two of you, you really need to decide the best time to talk to the children and really consider what their reactions are. So your spouse and you have made the decision to move forward, but put the brakes on not so fast. You're not only changing your own life in a big way, but you have children. So what to say when you're talking to your children? What is the best way to tell your children that their parents are getting a divorce or separated? So holding the conversation, what does that look like? When you hold the conversation with your children, you both need to start with telling the truth. So while you're entitled to your privacy, they're likely going to want to know why you are separating or divorcing. So give them a brief and age appropriate answer to help clarify that situation. So remind your children you love them. Your children, especially younger children, need this reassurance. They need to know you love them. Without that reminder, they may feel you could also fall out of love with them as well. Prepare for changes. Explain what is going to be different so they are not completely blindsided when confronted with the change. Point out what isn't going to change. You've told them what will change, what won't change. While your routines and normal activities will, some things may not. Point out those unchanged routines that you have and at this point, you might not know all of them and they might change, but tell them for present time what may or may not change. Avoid arguing. Arguing is going to make your child feel like they have to choose a side, isolate from either of you or become a mediator and that's not fair. Many times your children actually already have an idea that their parents' marriage is already failing. So you may think that they don't know, and maybe they don't, but many children already sense that there's something wrong in their parents' relationship. Avoid placing blame. Something very difficult when you may be going through a divorce. As we said, being a united front is so important, and even if you can't be united, you should somehow show some restraint when discussing the other person. That still is your child's parent. You're both still their parent. Placing that blame is going to impact your child. Listen, leave space and time for your children children to express their emotions and react to this news. If they don't have the words for their feelings, you can help by encouraging them to talk about what are they feeling. I'm hoping that this might give you a little bit of insight on how you can talk to your children regarding a divorce. Again, I'm here from O'Connor Family Law. The firm website is familylawma.com for more information. And I really hope that you have a great rest of your day.